Ooh, that seems to be the user control interface. You can control its entire functions from here. I can walk you through some of what you need to do. First things first, stop the toxic goo from pumping up. We should be able to contain it in test shaft Lima whiskey. Oh wait, Mel, before shutting this thing down completely, remember that there was a third target it was trying to take out? Well, we're not three, unless you can tell me otherwise. Try to see what you can do. Type um, ping underscore target underscore list. Am, am I reading this right? Was this thing trying to destroy her? It was targeting GLaDOS? Mel, what have we done? GLaDOS killed every scientist in this facility before being destroyed by a tenacious test subject. This thing, Aegis. It was trying to finish the job and flood the facility to destroy her. Mel, we might just have given GLaDOS a chance to get back in power. How could we have done that? Why didn't I see it sooner? Well, if you want to get out of here, now is your best chance. You don't want to be around when she comes back online. You should shut down Aegis now. Needs a passcode? It should be around here somewhere. Take a look around. Twenty fifty six. I've seen that number around a lot in this place. Strange. It's done. It's done. <laughs> Aegis is in its final shutdown sequence. Mel, come back to the lift. I can get you out of this facility. Okay, Mel. The elevator is in lockdown until you put your portal device in the incinerator over there. Uh, Mel, I, I just wanted to say something. Thank you. Thank you so much. Really, if it weren't for you, I would have drowned at the offices in the junkyard. I'm so sorry about lying to you in the beginning. It was a pretty bad Cave Johnson impression. <laughs> anyway, this thing should take you out of here, back to your normal life. Well, whatever you can call normal by this point. I don't know exactly what's out there, but it should be better than what's down here. So, just enjoy the rest of your life. Look, the elevator is here. See you later, Mel.
Thank you.